Oh my days. Oh my days. That looks friggin' amazing. Wow. Wow. Hello. Ladies and gentlemen. I'm out of this. The newest expansion for the Pokemon TCG Scarlet and Violet Paradox Rift has just released. And in today's video, we're going to be seeing how a Pokemon Center exclusive Paradox Rift Elite Trainer Box does against a regular retail Elite Trainer Box. Toasty. So without further scooby ado, let's get it. Alright guys, so here we have it. The Pokemon Center exclusive Elite Trainer Boxes versus the regular retail Elite Trainer Boxes. So we have the Roaring Moon Pokemon Center exclusive, the Iron Valiant Pokemon Center exclusive, and then the regular Roaring Moon Elite Trainer Box and then the Iron Valiant regular one. So just quickly, here's how the Pokemon Center ones look on the outside, on the front. So it's more of a zoomed in um, Roaring Moon right there. And here's the regular retail Roaring Moon. So it's more zoomed out. You get to see the full body of it. Um, there's the Iron Valiant. And there's the retail Iron Valiant. In my last video where I did the two Pokemon Elite Trainer boxes by themselves, I did the Roaring Moon first, I think. And then I left the Iron Valiant second. So this time around, I'm going to see... I'm going to put the two Pokemon... Sun well, I'm going to put the two ETBs together. But I'm going to start with Iron Valiant. So let me crack these open and I'll be right back. So here are the damage counters, condition markers, and die or dice die. But this one is um I didn't do it in my last video, which I did more of a detailed look in my last video, guys. But um the iron valiant, I think I skipped on the dice, but this one is more green and pink. Um in terms of Pokemon Center ETB and regular ETB, they're both the same contents apart from the stamped promo, which I'll show you in a second. So here's the tech dividers, the pole card for the iron valiant Pokemon Center one, and here are the two promos for the iron valiant. Elite Trainer Box, so the left one is Pokemon Center and the right one is the regular ETB. So the only difference out of the two ETBs is the Pokemon Center stamp promo. So there's your promo cards which I'm going to keep sealed. So if you want to see these in a detailed look guys, link in the description down below where I did just a normal Pokemon Center opening. And here's the sleeves. And then the difference between the regular and the Pokemon Center is 11 packs. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Did I just count that wrong? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Woof! Almost gave me the 11 packs in the Pokemon Center one and then 9 packs in the regular one. So here's your cold card for the regular Elite Trainer Box. And your nine packs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yep, perfect. Alright, guys, so before we start cracking into these packs, if you enjoy my videos and you haven't already, I'd appreciate if you could leave a like, subscribe, turn notifications on for more. When I reach 500 subscribers, I'll be the new boy for the most recent any trainer box as me hitting 500 subscribers. Without further scooby ado, let's get it. Alright, guys, so I think I'm going to start with the regular one. Yeah, I'll start with the regular one since I've already opened the Pokemon Center ones. Um, since I've already done that Pokemon Center opening as well, I'm going to go a little bit faster with these ones. Hopefully not make it as long as of a video, although there's 40 packs in this one, so it's probably going to be a long video anyway. So, grab your snacks guys, grab your drinks, sit back and relax, and let's see what we have in store for this versus battle between two, ET two ETBs. More peco. Right, so no first pack magic. Um, So far, my first video, my first opening for the two Pokemon and the ETBs that I did this video. Oh my days. For ETBs? Oof. I mean, granted the Pokemon Center ETBs, which to me always come through. For me anyway. Oh my days. Nice. Illustration rare Garganical. Nice. Second pack in as well. Nice, nice, nice. So that's a good pull right there. Alright, so second pack in the first pool. That could be the only pool even, but um, obviously it'd be better if you can pull from 9 packs out of the regular ETB. At least, I'd say 2, maybe 3 hits. Would be nice to pull 2, maybe 3. But um, to pull 1 at least, and it's IO. I'll be happy with that. I'll be happy with that. Silver Ring, the Nigo, Blitzel, what's what? Yeah, so my first opening. Oh my days, I can't believe it. Um, Link in the description down below, guys. Both ETBs. Both ETBs. Were stacked. More or less. Pretty much. 
Rarity wise, yes. Rarity wise, you might think otherwise, but um, definitely stacked in terms of pull rates. Eleven packs, and it was decent. Yahoo! Tiny shots, DX, nice. Um, I think I pulled this one already in my last video. Yeah, I think I pulled this one. As it loses focus, come on, focus, focus, focus. But Sandy Shocks the X, nice. So that's two pulls, not too bad. Alright, that's not bad. Two hits from nine packs. I'll, if that's all I'm gonna get, I think I'll take it. I think I'll take it. And EX and IO, not bad. I'll take it. Um, for me anyway, if that EX was in Sandy Shocks because I already pulled it, then it would be better. But other than that, still, I'll take it. That helps. Yeah, so guys, let me know in the comments down below if you're opening this set, if you're collecting this set, how your collection is going. Um, do you like the ancient and the future mechanic or forms, should I say, than the former wise? Um, yeah, let me know in the comments down below what you think of them. Also as well, what you think of if you've seen them or if you're not going to spoil yourself as well too much until you open your own, I guess. Um, what you think of the actual IRs and SIRs from this set are. Oh my days, for me, after looking at the player's guide from my last video, all of them look amazing. All of these like um, artworks. The IRs, SIRs, everything looks amazing. Let's Ooh. go! Nice. There's a hit that I'll definitely take. Mewtwo EX. Terraform. I know they didn't do Terraform in Scarlet and Violet 151, but why didn't they put an EX? Or, wait, did they do an EX? Mewtwo? Did they? Or Scarlet and Violet 151? Anyway, why didn't they do like a full or SIR for Mewtwo? I know they did the IR in the UPC, which is a promo, but in the set they should have done they did mute to dirty in the actual set anyway that's a nice pull right there two packs actually you know what for an etb i'll take that three exes so that's three pulls and I'll, I'll definitely take that definitely definitely take that an io and two exes one is a terraform ex which again i said in my other video if you're gonna pull in the ex the terraform ones are i would say slightly better to pull than the regular ones because of the little texture that they have because they're terraforms so i'll take that in some ways you can say that in, in a way two different rarities are not what they are because of the texture i guess like the terraforms are in a way replacing the vmaxes from sword and shield in some sense rather than reverse thing loot all right so regular etp etp down um not bad not bad for the regular one let's see versus the pokemon center one this is gonna be better oh it's gonna be a big one i, I don't know i mean i have actually one regular etb versus the pokemon center etb the regular etb came out on top and the pokemon center one was disgusting as in crap it was crap and this will i get that situation again okay obsidian flames this was the cross type this one the top type this time let's see if i can have a repeat or if there's gonna be a repeat of what happened to me in my I think, was it Obsidian? No, it was Scarlet and Violet 151 where I did like an opening of every, of every product and my Pokemon Center one was disgusting and the regular retail one was stacked. So too. But again, that in that video as well, in that video as well, that's where I can, my theory for batched um, Pokemon Center ETBs kind of broke down. But so far for Paradox Rift in my last video, like you saw, or if you haven't seen it, I'd love it if you can go back and watch it and I'd appreciate it as well. Came back. Alterio EX, nice. So, okay. Nice. And EX, Alterio. I'm hoping this is not the only pool, but we'll see. If my theory is right, I should be pulling one more EX, a full art, and an IR. And if I'm lucky, a bonus SIO. If I'm lucky. If I'm right as well. But we'll see. Hopefully I am. I really do hope I am. Because boy. I don't want to be disappointed with this ETB. Super EX Terraform. Nice. So there's two EXs. Oh, that's nice. That is a bit too much in some ways. With the Hooper. With all those rings. But that is a nice EX still. Alright, so two EXs so far from the Pokemon Center one. Um, hopefully a full art and the IR at least, another IR. The SIR I'm not too hopeful, but the full art and the IR. I'm hopeful, I'm hopeful. Following Phoebus, pick up. In terms of the game-wise as well, um... Oh, why is opening this way? It makes it harder for me. Um, yeah, I guess I can just do that. Um, yeah, that works. In terms of the game-wise, I think the new expansion... For the Area Zero or something, is releasing soon as well. In December, I believe. Oh, nice. Is that my first time pulling her? Press the stars. This is my chase card in terms of full art and SIO. Now that it's my chase card, I'm probably never going to pull it. Import. Minion IO. Okay, yes. It's looking up. It's looking up. It's actually looking up. Hopefully, 
my theories right. We've got a mini or IR, which is nice. That is actually nice. Nice. Lot. I don't even remember this Pokemon to be honest. Um, anyone in the comments, let me know which generation this is because I do not remember this Pokemon at all. But I like that. We got like basically the rainbow of all the mini or colors. Do they actually come in those colors? Oh, this is gonna be a long video. This is going to be a long video. Um, I'm already 20 minutes in. Kind of down, it might be short, but this is gonna be a long video. So if you're still here, guys, I really appreciate. Um, really appreciate it more if you leave a like, subscribe. Um, what was I gonna say? If you're still here, hold on. Edge slash. Yeah, if you're still here, grab some snacks, grab some, have a drink, sit back, relax, enjoy this opening. Hopefully, it's gonna be a good one. Hopefully, there's gonna be some sick balls, some stack balls, or chase ball, guns or tulip. More than happy not, but I only hope we're supported. And yeah, look forward to um, I think maybe paradox rift in terms of paradox rift. I'm probably gonna do a booster box. I don't know if I want to do the sleep boosters and the booster bundles. I have the free pack blisters and the single chicken blister open as well. That will probably be Thursday's video if you're watching this on Monday. If not, if I upload this on Thursday, you'll be seeing it Sunday. But yeah, uh, I don't know if I want to do sleep boosters and booster bundles, to be honest. Alright, last pack. Um if my theory is right, I should be getting a full lot in this one. If my theory is right, what well, I might not be getting that full lot in this one, and then it will be more or less an equal ETB battle. You can just judge it on a Pokemon more or less, and if that's the case, then I would say regular one won this one. Yahoo! Oh, it's not a full art. It's not a full art, but we put another EX, which is a Roaring Moon EX. Nice. That's a nice card. That's actually a nice card. Alright, so Roaring Moon, Elite Trainer Box time. Let me crack this open. So here's your two call cards for the Roaring Moon Elite Trainer Boxes. And here are your Screamtail. Four more cards. Alright, now it's time for Roaring Moon ETB Battle. But before we get into that guys, probably about halfway through the video. If you're currently enjoying the video and you stopped me this far, I'd appreciate it if you could leave a like, subscribe, turn notifications on for more. When I reach 500 subscribers, I'll be doing away for the most recent Elite Trainer Box because of me hitting 500 subscribers. Without further ado, be ado, let's get it. Right, so starting with regular ETB this time. Um, So this time, in terms of my theory, it didn't work out for the Pokemon Center Elite Trainer Boxes. Um, so in some ways, I mean, if it does work out, it actually does work. So theory that I'm not wanting to do that a lot. Um, if my theory does work out, then this I am valuing ETB, the Pokemon Center one, and I have three EXs and an IR. If my theory is right, if not, then I was completely wrong, and it's just not really batched. In some ways, it is. It's just, I would say the full art. In terms of actually my theory, the, it's the full art and the SIRs that you get different compared to the others. For example, Z. I forgot what they call a Coca for that one. Yeah, I think the, the difference is, I guess you could say, are the, um, the full art the SIRs, the higher, higher rarities, where it might be a bit different. Because I don't know. It, sometimes it proves right, sometimes it proves wrong. It's just all over the place. Yeah. Another one. Another one, why? Sandy Shots EX, so at least it's EX and it's a pull from the regular ETB. Alright, so there's our first pull from the regular ETB, the Sandy Shots EX. Are we going to be getting the same? Ooh, not nothing about it. Where I bought these regular ETBs is from the same shop. So, are these going to have that batched? So, what pull rate swing? Absolute, melodic. Are we going to see a Terraform? Well, two EXs anyway in the IR. I'm hoping for more. I'm really hoping for more. Would be nice to have more. Um, in this video, I might not even be pulling a full out or SIR to be honest. I might not. Screen tail, Professor Starters, Vitality, Kibble, Bipod. Let's go! Nice. Okay. God Trump EX Terraform. This is a nice card. This is a nice card. I can't wait to pull, to pull the full out and the SIR if I end up pulling them. Who knows if I do? God Trump EX Terraform. Right, I'll take that two hits so far from these nine packs. Um, Terraform and a regular EX. To be honest, with how many IRs there are in this set, I, I really want to pull more IRs. I think IRs are even harder, but like the hardest thing to pull from these recent sets. Um, oh, is that my first time seeing a reverse feature card or agent card? Nice. Oh, it has that kind of like mirror effect on it. Nice. Let's get Terraform. Yeah, IRs seem to be like they, they're the most, and then they kind of seem to be the hardest to pull. I mean, you get three in a booster box, between two and three in a booster box, so that's probably your best way to pull them. But and then at the same time, doing that as well for booster boxes, you could be pulling multiple, multiple multiples. So I don't know. Oh, Let's yes. Go! Polygon Z. IR. Yes. Yeah. 
all right with two packs left. Um, it looks exactly the same. Minus the IR and the Terraform EX has been different so far in terms of pull, pull rate and pull rarity. Exactly the same for the two regular ETBs and some different cards. Nice pull, evolved form panel thing there. I'm ready. Give me gold. Is that it? And last pack. Come on, give me some last pack magic. Give me some SIR or full up last pack magic. Come on, come on. Give me some full up SIR last pack magic. Double, Wismo, double A, Tuskit, Minja, Rika, Reverse Jolte. Damn it. We'll see. Run. All right, time for the Pokemon Center ETB. Pokemon Sense ETB. Let's see if this one's gonna hold up to be the same. So, if so, I'm not gonna be pulling any full arts or any SIRs in this video. Or oh, in this opening at all. 40 patch and all 40 packs. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. To be honest, booster box pull rates in some ways. It is 4 packs more than a booster box spot. I mean, it doesn't have the, the seeded, I guess, pull rates of the booster box where you're guaranteed, I think, around 2 full arts, an SIR, or whole, whole card, stuff like that. But hit rate wise, it's getting there. Hit rate wise, yeah, um, 8 hits so far. 3, 4, 6, wait, 3, 4, 6, 8, 10, 10 hits so far, I mean, and. Average of getting between 12 and 13 hits from my booster box. If I can pull off a lot on SI, then it'll be perfect. It'll be more or less perfect booster box hit rates. Yahoo! Another Mewtwo EX. Terrible. <laughs> oh, I'm happy about seeing a lot of doubles so far. But I'll take it. Alright, so our first EX from the Pokemon Sun Elite Trainer box. It's a Terraform as well. So I'm going to get two more EXs and an IR. Trubbish. Give me a goal. Biglet. Jirachi. And Bundle. Sky score. Future Energy Capsule, Deoxys. Oh my days. Oh my days. That looks friggin' amazing. Wow. Wow. We just put the gold iron violin EX. Oh. That looks amazing. Ooh. In person, guys. In person. This gold card looks freaking amazing. Holy. You have to. Oh my days. This gold card looks amazing in, in, in person. You have to see this in person, guys. Oh my glam shot might even do it even more justice. Wow. Nice. I was absolutely not expecting that pull, guys. Wow. Oh my days. That looks. Oh, that gold card looks amazing. That gold card actually looks amazing. The way they did the background this time with the kind of future. There in oh my wow that was amazing i want to see the ancient the roaring moon one now if it's just as good in person probably all Z. nice pulling a gold card as well nice 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 so i've just about pulled every rarity from this set yeah i've pulled every rarity from this set now nice yes yes i'll take that yep so i pulled the sir in the last video in yesterday's video course last Sunday's video, the first video of the Pokemon Center, the Trinobox video. Um Yahoo! I am Valiant ETB, possibly. Hopefully. I am Valiant EX, nice. That's seeing another future um EX Pokemon right there. Sit. Oh that gradient and then the stars. This is so nice. Paradox Rift cards, nice. <laughs> Five packs left, guys, and we pulled a gold card and two EXs. Yeah, a gold card and two EXs, nice. No, um, we're gonna pull the IO, we're gonna pull the IO. I'm hoping so. Russell, Dot Law, Russell, Night Card, Pro, Minio, Timmy Four, Pokemon Law, Pokemon Machine, and more. I said in my last video that I don't want to go too heavy into Paradox Rift because I want to complete my past sets like the Scarlet and Violet, Champ, um, Obsidian Flames, Scarlet and Violet 151, Powder Evolve. But right now, I'm tempted to just buy a case of booster boxes for this set and just go heavy oh. I was happy but and then it's just I just thought about it this could have been Sada Professor Turo scenario full up I'll take it obviously <sighs> told you I can never pull my chase cards I can never pull my chase cards, especially the big ones, like the Sardot and the SIR version. Oh man! Um, this ETB might just be more or less going in line with my other videos ETB. But I think this exact same Iron Valiant, was it Roaring Moon? Is this Roaring Moon? I think the Roaring Moon. No, it was Iron Valiant. But the pull rates from this one, or the hits in this ETB, kind of the same as in the last video. Or one of the boxes from my last video anyway. Well, I think two EXs are full of SIR and IR. So right now I'm just missing an IR. Um, 
With the last two remaining packs doesn't cool. Yeah! Another EX, nice. Going moon again, another double up. Sheesh, give me something else, please. Alright, last pack. So we pulled got three X's this time. Three X's. A full up and a goal. Yeah, so we're missing IR. We're not gonna pull IR. We are not going to be pulling IR in this one. Damn it. I really wish it was IR instead of that rolling moon. Last four, top four, top lady. Alright, guys, so regular ETB. Pokemon Center ETB. Uh, <laughs> there's no question about it. There's definitely no question about it. It's we pulled the gold iron valiant ex and a full art and then i'd say more hits from the pokemon center atb which is 22 packs compared to 18 um regular etb we put more or less exactly the same in terms of rarities in each box so from the first box we put the carnacle and the sandy shocks and the mutual ex from the second box we put the Porygon zir sandy shocks and then garchomp so minus the sandy shocks these two were different, same rarity but different, and then we put two Sandy Shocks, yes, from the exact same regular ETB. But, um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine hits from 22 packs through the two Pokemon and ETBs, not bad. So that's nine, and then one, two, three, four, five, six. 15 hits from 40 packs, and that's actually more or less booster box rarities like hit wise as well so three um irs average one two three four i mean definitely more exes than a booster box but and then a full art i think you get two full arts in a booster box and then either gold card or sir but yeah guys that was the pokemon center exclusive etbs versus the regular retail etbs let me know in the comments down below which one won and which etbs are your favorite in terms of Rory moon or iron valiant or if you prefer Pokemon Center, if you can't even get your hands on them, the Pokemon Center exclusive ones or the regular ones. But yeah guys, if you enjoyed the video, if you stuck with me to the end, I'd appreciate it if you could leave a like, subscribe, turn on the for more. When I reach 500 subscribers, I'll be doing giveaway for the most recent big trainer box of me hitting 500 subscribers. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.